Hi everyone, this is Gail, and welcome to my Friday Frolics. Um, don't have a lot to tell you today, just trying to give you an idea of what my week has been like. Um, I did start back to my exercise classes this week after being sick for almost a month, and I did not make it through the first class. I had to stop about halfway through and just sit down. I just could not lift my leg another time. I couldn't walk another step. I don't know when I have ever felt total exhaustion like I did on Monday. So when I came home, I sat down to rest for a minute and fell asleep and slept for two hours. So there goes my Monday. Um, Tuesday, it was a rainy day, and I did not go anywhere Tuesday. I decided not to try to go to exercise class Tuesday morning. I needed to give my body a chance to recuperate. And, um, have you know, I've got just things to do. I need to go to the grocery store. I need to go to the post office. I need to go to the drugstore. All these things that need to be done, and then when I get home, I was just totally wiped out, so I'm still working on building my stamina back. But I did go to class yesterday, but I rested before I went to class, and I made it through the entire class. So I'm slowly getting there, but I feel good. I really do. I feel good, except I'm still just tired. But um, I did get into the clay room and tried to start a project, and it was a total fail, so I had to ball everything up. So that was the only time I've had to get into the clay room, so I haven't got a tutorial done yet. Hopefully I can get one done between now and Monday so that you can have something. You know, it may be something really simple, but I want to have something for you on Monday. And again, I have not started my Patreon tutorial, although I do know what I want to do. Um, I just haven't had time to get to it yet. So hopefully in the next week or so, maybe two, things can get back to normal. And I can, because Tuesday and Thursday are my regular filming days, my days that I have that I can film. And I just haven't had time on Tuesdays and Thursdays this, this week. Um, it's, it's really been hard. Today I get a haircut. My hair is so bushy and long. It's all I can do to keep it out of my face. And I may go rogue and get it cut really, really short. We'll see what she says when I get there. But it's going to be nice over the weekend. Uh, tomorrow, my oldest son, who has been taking Taekwondo karate for many, many years, and he's already a fifth degree uh, black belt. He's uh, a master. And tomorrow, he tests for his sixth degree. So that's exciting. And then some friends of his that I've gotten to know through the years, they're testing for their seventh degree and his main mentor other than the guy that owns the studio but his friend that's been his friend ever since the very beginning is going for grand master so i'm really excited to see that so uh, it's going to be an exciting day tomorrow but again it's going to take up the whole day so i'm not going to have any time to video tomorrow unless i do it late tomorrow afternoon or sun late sunday afternoon so but i'm going to try i promise i'm going to try um, if not, maybe I'll throw in another Patreon video. I'd like to know, how did you like that Patreon video? That was one of the simpler ones because I wanted one that wasn't an hour and a half long. Um, it was the tiger skin, and I know it was one of my favorites. I really enjoyed making that cane and then using it. I love the pendant that was made with it. So, um, you know, let me know what you thought about it and what you think about once a month, maybe, I will share an old Patreon video with you. Uh, I don't think my patrons would mind if I do that because they've had theirs for a long time. Some of them, you know, well over a year. <coughs> and also, I'd like to know what, how you feel about an hour and a half, you know, video because uh, some of them are extensive and 
you know, I could try to break them down into parts, but I would have to download them first onto my computer and then edit it into two parts and then upload them again. And again, that takes time. Um, I just, you know, it's just a lot going on right now. Uh, you know, it's, it's crazy. Uh, my daughter and I are contemplating the idea of selling our house. Um, we're not thinking like, like right away, but uh, as it is now, see, my daughter, my daughter has lived with me before for a while. Then when we bought this house, I had to buy it in my name because her credit wasn't really good at that time. And um, so it's my house, and she's paying half of the expenses. What I want to do, because of my age and everything else, I want to get a house in her name and me live with her, and I'll pay her half of the expenses. It'd be a whole lot cheaper for me to do that than what I'm doing now. And, um, but, you know, it's, it's not going to happen anytime soon. Uh, there's so much that needs to be done to this house. Carpet needs to be replaced. Um, some needs to be totally done away with. You know, there's some painting that needs to be done. There's some things that, you know, I can't do, so I have to depend on my son or other people to do things for me. So, uh, it's, you know, it's going to be at least a year, but we're just in the thinking phase now. Um. You know, it's, it's hard when you, you know, I, I swore when I moved into this house, I'd never move again. But it's becoming a challenge uh, for our needs. And I think it would be better for both of us if we had a place where she could have her space and I could have my space. Right now, the bedrooms are right next to each other. And the only place we have to, to sit is in the living room. And... You know, so she's always in here in the living room with me. We're always having to say, what do you want to watch on TV? I don't know. What do you want to watch on TV? So it would be nice if we either had a den or if we had a split floor plan where I could have my craft room next to my bedroom and I could just kind of be isolated on one end of the house and then she could have her area on the other side of the house. And we would have a living room, but that living room... You know, if she wanted to go or I wanted to go somewhere else to sit and watch TV, we'd be able to do that. So that's something we need to think about. But anyway, it's just in the thinking mode right now. We may totally change our mind before too long. But uh, that's kind of scary for me. And uh, my car is getting rather old. It's 13 years old. It's a 2005 uh, Honda CRV, and it's only got 112,000 miles on it, so it's really not in bad shape other than cosmetically. It does need a paint job, and there's a few little things that need to be done to it, but you know, that can be done, that's a whole lot cheaper than a car payment, and a Honda with only 112,000 miles on it should last me another 100,000 miles. So we'll just see how that goes, but it's just always something. You know, there's big things. Uh, you know, we've got to think now about paying off the uh, heat pump as early as we can so we don't go over. It was a free financing for 24 months, but if you didn't get it paid in the 24 months, then they go back to the beginning and charge you like 26% interest. So we're trying to get that paid off. But anyway, it's just life. Um, I really can't think of anything this week that I've done otherwise that I need to tell you about. Uh, except I'll just be so glad to get this hair cut. But anyway, I will be back again next Friday for another Friday Frolics. Hopefully I'll have a little bit more to talk to you about. This week has been a pretty boring week because I've done... When I have done things, then I've had to sleep for a couple hours to recuperate. So I'm sure that will change soon, hopefully. I'm not a person that likes to sit. So um, come back again next Friday for another Friday Frolics. And join me Monday, hopefully, for another Polymer Clay video tutorial. So thanks a lot. Love you guys. Bye-bye.